Hello YouTube and today I'm going to show you some basic intervals like to create musical phrases using um, chords and scales and what have you and um, so I just made a medley of uh, some basic intervals that I use a lot I mean I use them use I, I you can use them with anything but today I'm using them with um, the piano because um, it shows uh, what keys I hit over here and whatnot and shows you how I'm playing them but you could like for instance if you want to put this as a brass part you can put this as a brass part and whatnot so let's hop right in so this first pattern is um starts with the C and then it's um the fifth and then I go up a note and that's that basic pattern and this next pattern is um something like that and I, I, I heard that before I think I actually heard it just how it is like that Like, like I think, like I, I can, I can hear the lyrics of that one song. You know, you. I don't even know how it goes. It's like a really high pitched guy saying, "I know I love you" or something. Um. Yeah, I think that was a Bruno Mars song or something. This next little progression, the uh, next little pattern is. So that's basically how that one goes. And this one is just basically a rise up. And it's perfect at where it was, at like an end point or something. So it goes. It's pretty legit. And then this one, I think, is um. This one's actually the chord itself being arpeggiated. Yeah, and you can move it just like that. With all these, you can do that. You can move move these anywhere you want. Over here, I got like a little rhythmic sound going on. You hear that a lot. It's um. Something like that. <clears throat> it's really nice. Nice just to fill in there to fill up some space. Um, over here I got like a got, what is this? I got kind of like a C to an E, kind of like a little chord going on there going. Kind of something like that. And then again, that's just a chord fill, you know. I mean, it happens. So let me just run you through every all these patterns. That's basically how they go. You can use different instruments, like I said. I mean, I don't know what would happen if right now I break out. Um, well, I really don't have a a brass loaded and ready. 
Yeah, yeah, like it doesn't sound good. Yeah, well, you get the point of it. But yeah, that's just um some few intervals that happen a lot that I notice <laughs> a lot in music. All these are pretty much noticeable, and you hear them all throughout the spectrums and so yeah thanks for watching and comment rate subscribe check out my other videos which are all also very helpful and just um, use these patterns wherever you want and um, I might make an FLP of this and might put that in the description if you guys want it so yeah thank you